We are in southern Spain, a circuit called Monte Blanco. We're here with T50S, both XP1 and XP2. Making sure all the things we've done so far are, are working as they should. From all the work we did in Navarra and Jerez um, at the end of last year, putting that to a different circuit here, different challenges, different corner complexes on XP1, still focusing on the powertrain work and on XP2 looking at the chassis setup, aero balance work. We've got slightly different weather, so it means we can carry on with traction control in the dry, speeding up the gear change again, different slicks, different compounds, and just yeah, keep going with the development. Cars are running faultlessly, really. We're taking different work from each car, putting it into the other car, and mm. each driver assessing it. I've been fine-tuning the traction control because all the learning we had in the wet weather testing has held us in good stead but the running on slicks for the first four or five modes has got to be tuned so it does give you uh, a, an amount of yaw before it comes in so it just lets the lets the driver have a, a bit of freedom on exit of a corner just just feel like they you know they can they can properly load the car before the, the traction cuts in and then when it does lovely and smooth as it as it cuts and then just reins them back in it's a bespoke system so it does take a, a lot of effort and a lot of different types of driving style as well so you go into the corner sometimes you go you feed it in gently and other times slam it in and so you're, you're always the first to test it so that's always uh, can be quite exciting so over on xp2 we've been focusing on chassis setup and a bit more of the aerodynamics. The focus on this car over these two weeks in Monte Blanco is getting a, a stable platform, mm -hmm. not only taking some learning from where we got in Navarre and Jerez and all the other circuits we've been, but again, applying that to this circuit here. Yeah, and also it's really good learning when we are changing, but if someone does want a track that's you know more bumpy, we've got, we could go for a softer setup and we can go for a super smooth track say when, you know, like Abu Dhabi or something like that, which is uh, fast and aero based. But it, it's all good learning. I think the, the focus as well is not only on outright pace and performance, no. but keeping it driver friendly. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, it's got to be enjoyable. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's got to be fun to drive. You know, that's, the, that's the main thing, really. It's got to be, uh, it's got to be driver focused. We're not chasing lap times. They come naturally anyway when you make a car <laughs> this light and this 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 powerful but it's making the car fun thing to drive <laughs> 